So I did the end video drivers that were included in Ubuntu 12.04 fall off a cliff? Well, yes, they did. They were rubbish. And I had quite a few crashes which were attributed to the dodgy drivers that were included in Ubuntu 12.04. Driver package 295.40. So, in this video I'll be showing you how to update the drivers and force a newer version and hopefully improve some stability issues. Mind you, if you've got an NVIDIA card and you're not having trouble, then you uh, probably don't need to use this. So, yeah, why fix what's not broken? Anyway, what you need to do is add this repository for the XORG updates, and that gives you driver 295.53. Or, if you're really brave, you could use an even more update driver, you can use the XORG Edges PPA. Uh, although this is unstable, so probably not recommended, but if you did want to use it, then you can have driver 302.11 and you get a new Linux kernel, kernel 3.4. Anyway, what I'll be showing you is the stable PPA for XORG, and I'll show it working in VirtualBox because I've already done it on my system. So what you need to do is open up terminal, so that's Control alt and T, and you need to paste the commands that are included in the description below, so that's sudo add apt repository, Ubuntu xwatt x updates, uh, pop in your administrator password, and yes it mentions you're about to install this driver, so press enter to add it. That's done, and we need sudo apt get update and then finally sudo apt get dist upgrade now you'll notice there that it's missing the nvidia drivers but that's because it's in virtualbox and not actually using the nvidia drivers but if you did that it would update your nvidia drivers there right so having done that update just close so shut down and restart and when you boot back in, it'll be the latest version of the NVIDIA driver. And you'll see that if you start typing NVIDIA, so the X server settings, you see there, NVIDIA driver version 295.53. So there you go, simple as that. And hopefully that'll improve some stability issues for anyone who's having trouble with the NVIDIA drivers. So thanks for watching, see you later.